On behalf of Corinne and Austin, I want to welcome each and every one to this very, very significant service. I remember when I first saw you, you were smiling. Corinne and Austin, today you have invited your family and friends to witness something that started some time ago. Your love for each other has blossomed to a point that today you have decided to become husband and wife. This world in which we live in is lacking something that both of you happen to have within your hearts. And that is a great deal of love. There are three things we know last forever. Faith, hope, and love. And the greatest of them all is love. And today I'm delighted to join with all here, family and friends alike, in wishing you both a very, very long, happy, and healthy life together. Amen. It has been an honor to stand by your side, not only today, but for the past 27 years. Fortunately for me, our special bond throughout the years turned from cousins and best friends to becoming the sisters we both never had. You are such a special person. I could not be happier for you today seeing you marry your best friend. As we're here tonight honoring Austin, moving on to the next stage of life, I want to let you know that I'm proud of you and the guy that you've become. You're one of the best guys that I know, and one of the clearest ways that you've shown your character is in the woman you've chosen for your wife. I realized Austin was a special person when I first met him. Uh, not only make a great impression on Corinne, but he also grew up my attention too. He's going to make a great husband. Seeing Corinne for the first time in that little pink blanket, right up to today in her beautiful wedding dress. There wasn't a day she didn't impress me. She's truly a wonderful person. You have chosen a great person to be your partner for life. So I like to raise our glasses and wish them a happy, healthy life together. I love them both very much. Cheers. I pronounce that you are now husband and wife. Austin, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>